The question is Lina sold goods to Mina on March 2009 for 68,000. In the books of Mina, purchases account debited to Lina. This is 2013 March 1 purchases account debited to Lina. Being goods sold, purchased on credit from Lina, rupees 68,000 in debit and credit column. And Lina is selling to Mina. So Mina debited to sales same debt, sales account. Rupees 68,000 in the debit and credit columns being goods sold on credit to Mina and drew two bill of exchange of the equal amount upon Mina payable after three months. Fine, two bills. Hence, in the books of Mina, Lina debited rupees 68,000 to bills payable number one account rupees 32,000 to bills payable number two account rupees 32,000 being the acceptance given to Lina and. Lina is getting the acceptance from Mina. That is, bills receivable account debited, number one account debited 32,000. Bills receivable number two account debited 32,000 to Mina rupees 68,000. Being the acceptance of a Mina received. Lina immediately discounted the first bill with her bank at a 12% per annum. He got the first bill discounted at the rate of 12% per annum. That is bank account debited, discount account debited to bills receivable number one account. Being the acceptance number one of Mina discounted at bank and discount of rupees 32,000 at the rate of 6% for three months, rupees 480 allowed. That is bank account debited rupees 67,520, discount account debited rupees 480 to bills receivable number one account 32,000. And there will be no entry in the books of Mina. And the bill was designed by Mina and paid 55 as noting charges. And the second bill was retired on 4th May 2009 under a rebate of 6% with mutual agreement. Hence, the second bill's date came first in 4th May. Bills payable number 2 account debited 32,000 to cash account 31,840 to rebate account 160. I will explain you this rebate in the books of Lina, how it was calculated, being the acceptance number 2 given to Lina retired under rebate. In the books of Lina, cash account debited 31,840 rupees, rebate account debited rupees 160. To bills receivable number 2 account that is rupees 32,000 being cash received for bill number 2 and rebate allowed rupees 32,000 into 6 percent for one month because the bill was drawn on March 1, March 1 to April 1, April 1 to May 1 or May 4. Two month, months elapsed, hence one month is left out, hence the drawer will allow rebate of only one month. Hence, one month is taken into consideration. And the second bill, which will due after one month, June 4, 4th June, it is a degenerate. Hence, in the, on 4th June, bills payable number one account debited rupees 32,000, noting charges account debited 55 rupees to Lena 32,055 rupees. Being acceptance number one given to Lena, Dijanad and the holder bank paid rupees 55 as noting charges. Then the next one being on 4th June, Mina debited 32,055 to bank account 32,055. Being the acceptance of Mina discounted at bank Dijanad and noting charges paid by bank rupees 55. And total is 232,055 both in the debit and in the credit column it will be rupees 2 lakh 55 rupees and this is the final answer